Next book. Is he writing another Nikki Heat novel? The deal was for one book. That's uh, where I outline my books. It's funny. Looks a lot like our murder board. Well, the man is going to write another book about you. I am not Nikki Heat, sir. This um, female detective of yours, exactly how much will she be based on me? She's going to be... She's going to be really smart. Give me love. Very savvy. Go ahead. I need the practice. Go ahead, I need the practice. That was classic. Haunting good looks. Maybe I've been waking up alone. Really good at her job. I am going to do everything in my power to make sure that they pay for what they did. You really makes you a nice character on Detective Beckett? Every artist needs a muse. <laughs> Call me a muse again and I will break both your legs. Okay? Okay. Alright, I'm going to leave you guys to it. So what would Nikki Heat do after a bad day? She'd go home. Pour a stiff drink. On a hot bag. Read a good book. So you'd be okay if I didn't write another Nikki Heat? It's not like I asked you to write the first one. You just do whatever you want to do. You always do anyway. Three books? Are you coming or what? A writer and his muse. Hey! Hey! Ask me one this. You know, I ask myself that question every day. What do you do? What? How long have you two been sleeping together? We're, we're not sleeping together. We, he, he just observes me. Yeah, I see okay. him observes you. I'm still amazed give me love. at the depths of your strength. Your heart. Give me love. My, my, and your hotness. Give me love. Your book is being made into a movie. And you are about to be immortalized on the silver screen. Actually, Nikki Heat is going to be immortalized, not me. He's in you. But you're determined not to give into these feelings that you clearly have for him. So he fantasizes about you through his writing. Wait, there's a sex scene in the book? There's a sex scene in the book between Nikki Heat and the roguishly handsome reporter who's helping her. Maybe I what happened? <gasps> I knew you were reading it. Is that the, uh, the dedication? Wow, thank you. I meant to. You are extraordinary. It's on page 105, by the way. What? That sex scene you're looking for. And it's your rage, right? It's to me. I was in. You to me. No, I just want to hold you. Give a little time to me. Burn this out, we'll play high. From now on, I'm a one writer girl. Is the taste that your lips allow? My mind, my mind. The weekend hasn't turned out exactly as you had imagined. But now nothing could stop me from getting exactly what you desired. All I want is the taste that your lips allow. My mind, my mind. Give me love. Nikki Heat. Nikki Heat. Wow, it's complicated, she said. Thinking man's come. You are infamous for being the inspiration for the fictional NYPD detective Nikki Heat, who spends more time on her back than she does pursuing killings. We writers call this the inciting incident. Sir, if you would look at my record. We are looking at your record. You are not qualified to be a detective. Most people come up against a wall, they give up. Put your hands up, Dunn, or I will take you down. You're wrong, sir. Nikki, he's wrong. And regarding my relationship with Mr. Castle, he has proven to be a brilliant partner. Seven years ago, I thought I would never write again. And then you walked through the door. And he's always had my back. My whole world changed. And as for his fictional representation of me, I'm proud to have been his inspiration, and I am proud to be his wife. She is, after all, aren't you? Our castle. Every writer needs inspiration. And I found mine. Give me love.